feels so good to feel like a, 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 a temperature change, you know, in New York after it being so cold for so long. It's like, I can even feel my mood is different, you know? I don't know if you have that, if, if weather has that effect on you, but for me, it's like the, the weather and the seasons deeply affect me. But these days, it's not in a negative way. It's almost like um, winter represents a time to go in, inward and to spend a lot more time being introspective. And then spring is time to clean and like look at the stuff that you've been looking at and weighing up and options and then get rid of the things that don't serve you and keep the things that you wanna that you want to keep in your life and then summer is just a time to enjoy and be outward and to share some of those gifts that you cultivated and looked at and selected during spring and then autumn is again a time to calm down again and to get prepared for going inward again that's kind of how i see the seasons and i feel like that's how i use the seasons to my advantage um, but in the past i feel like the seasons used to um, control me more than me just kind of like um, seeing what they're about and learning from them I just felt like they would sling me this way and that when it was winter I'd get so depressed and stuff like that and then in summer I'd be like super happy um, and like all about everything everything would just be like the most amazing thing ever um, but now it's like I'm a lot more conscious of like my relationship to the seasons and in a way like working in tandem with the seasons anyway yeah I'm just so happy to be outdoors and in the sun to be honest um, all right, I'll, I'll check in with you guys later. Now that I'm at the fifth episode of this vlog experiment series and essentially the last episode, I have been feeling more and more free to watch other people's work because I feel like that can help me feel more comfortable with different forms. And on this particular evening, I was watching a live stream of documentaries by some students and I thought that the work was really really beautiful and it got me really inspired with my own process as you know i really enjoy baking and this day i made some garlic rolls the first time i tried to make them was a big fat flop this was the second time i tried them and they came out so fluffy so perfect just like i wanted them to be i was super proud because it takes so long to make these Every now and then I dress up and in this particular case it was inspired by my hair and how good I feel in this hair which is almost a miracle to be honest so yeah enjoy my outfit here's my outfit and I'm gonna mess around with the keyboard because literally what happened was that I so I was like feeling good in my hair I was like oh my hair would look good with this ear these earrings and then it escalated to let's see what's gonna look like with this top let's see what it looks like with this skirt next thing you know I'm wearing a full outfit I didn't go as far as makeup though I felt too lazy for that because I have to wash it off but then as soon as I got back into the bedroom I was like yo keyboard and then I went on to my own little fantasy world where I was like imagine I'm a fucking DJ in Europe DJing to like crowds and crowds of people and I started messing with the keyboard and I actually made some beats they're not beats that I'm super proud of but they're beats you know <laughs> or like melodies maybe beats is, is taking it too far they're melodies um, but anyway I just wanted to give you a little bit of insight into what the heck is going on 
Another thing that is super important to explain is that the main reason or the dream with playing around with the keyboard is that one day I will be able to create my own sounds for my own films. So I've been experimenting and playing around with different combinations of sounds and what emotion they evoke with the hopes that one day I'll be able to use these and actually have them in my own films. And here's a short little sample of what I came up with in this short little session that I had. just popping in quickly to say thank you so much for tuning in and i'll see you again next week thursday same time same place have a good one